Delivering consumer merchandise by commercial drones is an innovative concept. Retail companies and tech startups are extensively testing drone flight technology in real life situations. Commercial drones are also being used for first aid to ship medicine and supplies in emergency situations. As for cinema, drones are an economical means to get great footage without using helicopters. The rise of drones and their popularity makes it critical to use simulation tools to predict their performance and safety in realistic scenarios. In the next few minutes you'll see ANSYS tools solving diverse engineering challenges during various stages of the drone delivery process. Drones combined with warehouses manned by robots and self-driving carts are simulated using ANSYS. These simulations predict performance and safety of delivering a package to its destination. You'll see how ANSYS products enable innovations that could lead to an autonomous future for industrial applications. Imagine that you place an online order and choose the air delivery option. Your order is relayed to the nearest warehouse. Upon receipt, a robot fetches the goods from the correct shelf and transports them to the shipment area for packaging. A drone takes off automatically with your package. Guided by GPS, it flies at a safe altitude and navigates around obstacles in an urban environment to find the right location. Finally, it delivers the package at your doorstep. We need to solve many technical problems and practical issues for this to work. Even before the drone lifts off, we need to address wireless connectivity, EMI and EMC, and wireless device performance issues in the warehouse and flight path. Multiple radios in the warehouse can lead to co-site RF interference issues. More problems arise when the drone soars into the sky. For instance, the Federal Aviation Administration requires commercial drones fly below 400 feet avoiding obstacles while navigating to the customer site. When the wind is strong, the drone must still follow its flight path and deliver the package. Solutions to these design and engineering problems can be found by 3D physics simulations using ANSYS tools. We'll start at the warehouse where many wireless devices and equipment exist with the goods kept in stock. Antennas being key components of wireless devices must operate efficiently to ensure proper communication. For instance, the central control unit uses a triple band antenna to communicate with equipment in the warehouse. ANSYS HFSS can analyze these antennas in their local environments and predict their characteristics. Radiation patterns help you visualize the directions in which the antenna radiate. Knowledge of electric fields generated by these antennas can help deal with EMC aspects of the control unit. Upon receiving the online order, the central control unit determines the package location and allocates a robot closest to the shelf for pickup. The robot receives RFID tag information to identify the correct package. The robot's RFID reader operates at 900 MHz and its wireless communications link operates at 5.8 GHz. The robot moves the package to the conveyor belt. An RFID reader system scans the tag and conveys shipment information to a printer in the vicinity which prints the shipment label. Another pick-and-place robot fixes the label on the package. A drone makes its way to pick up the package for delivery, communicating with the warehouse at 2.45 GHz and the outside environment at 5.8 GHz. Its GPS antenna operates at 1.575 GHz. The warehouse is a large and complex electromagnetic environment with several antennas. You can simulate this entire environment using finite elements and other solvers in HFSS. For these electrically large environments involving geometries thousands of wavelengths in size, HFSS SBR Plus is suitable for rapidly solving antenna performance and antenna-to-antenna -antenna coupling issues. ANSYS EMIT with its built-in radio and component models can solve for all the interactions among the radios in the full warehouse to predict how each wireless sensor will perform. With the wireless systems functioning properly and devoid of any RFI issues, the drone is set to take off for delivery. This virtual prototype of the city in ANSYS space claim shows the flight path from warehouse to customer site. Our multi-physics analyses can predict many issues arising during the flight path. This drone can sustain a maximum force of 2 newtons exerted by 35 knot winds. Airflow streamlines and contour plots in ANSYS AIM predict wind pressures, patterns, and direction. Shown here is a color-coded altitude for skyscrapers. Red zone represents the maximum flying altitude for the drone. 
which has to pass around obstacles to stay below 400 feet. ANSYS CFD uses computational fluid dynamics to analyze drone propellers under acceleration to plot dynamic pressure fields. Due to restriction in flying zones and variable weather conditions, these simulations offer critical insights into potential problems that the drone may face on its course. ANSYS tools can help expedite accurate design and reduce risk. All this simulation effort leads to successful delivery of your package. The popularity and promise of commercial drones offers many opportunities for industrial IoT applications. Simulation tools from ANSYS can predict efficacy of operations involving drones leading to compressed design cycles, therefore saving costly empirical testing. Thanks for watching.